So my project, it's mostly an installation of sculptures uh, using a lot of found objects and I like to mix and match and put them together with a sort of concept that I have in my head. Um, right now the theme, it's been ever changing uh, and evolving uh, and it's a reflection of how I feel my life's journey has gone so far. This piece, it's really all been about learning more about myself, um, how I operate and navigate through life, um, what I've learned along the way, what I look forward to, um, and just all about being in the now. Um, the idea just kind of came to me. Uh, I mean, a lot of people are working on paintings and, and sculptures, and I was trying to force myself to come up with this idea of doing a bunch of paintings or um, doing a bunch of sculptures, but I had a hard time landing on a concept idea for it. And so I just kind of look to what I do in my everyday life and who I am and how I came to art in the first place. And that was through going on walks and finding objects and I'd pick them up or draw them or fasten them into some sort of sculpture piece. And that's where I got the idea to go along with this. and just took aspects from my life that I enjoy and have fun doing and just kind of made it bigger. So my thesis is kind of, it's based on myself. So it's like one big fragmented self portrait and it's about like my insecurities and my struggles with mental health like through my life. And it's kind of like a way for me to like tell people without telling people and it's kind of breaking down that wall of like fear of people finding out kind of thing. So last year we did a project of the self and it was a self portrait project and that's when I did the face portrait and after that it was such a big like inspiration for me because I was like oh my gosh wow like I'm capable of doing like this much like how much more can I do after that and it really just sprung like this entire idea and then after I painted the hands in the same year and then I knew that this was going to be my thesis project because it could just keep going and going and going. <laughs> Probably like the most free I've felt in this whole program because it's really just exploring who I am and who I will be like once I leave here and it's just, I don't know, it feels like I'm spreading my wings. Yeah, so my project is about the unspoken conversations you have within your own um, relationships in your life. So all of my paintings revolve around each other and look like they're kind of dynamically dancing with each other. Um, there's going to be sculptural pieces coming out of different portions of them interacting with the other paintings as well as a center bust. So I'm in the process of building an ionic column and I'm going to have a plaster cast bust of myself on it and they're all going to be interacting. So it's kind of the group dynamic aspect of relationships and like how everyone interacts with each other. And like, you know, if you went further than just my thesis, you could go into one specific person's painting and do the same thing with theirs and how their relationships interact. and. Uh, yeah, it's, I'm really interested in psychology, so it's kind of all that brought together. Uh, just the, like, just, even just seeing my friends just paint, honestly, paint or do art, it's just it's so cool. Like, I, I love doing art myself, but I love, like, seeing my friends do it themselves. Like, it's just so, like, just, I don't know, it's so, I guess, intriguing is the word, but also just, like, I love seeing how, how they, like, the, the, way, the way they paint, the, like, the reason they paint. I'm saying paint, like just in general, like you know how they do art, um, like digital drawing, whatever. But um, I don't know. I just I think the variety, I guess, is the word. Like it's just cool to me.